Hi everyone, it's Bobby Joe Claywell from Blue Mind Divers and Billy Joe Harnett from Azart.org again. Today we are going to make a traditional origami goldfish and we are going to make him um, in the traditional way and then at the end we are also going to make him a fancy tail as you see on the one we have here. The supplies that you're going to need today are a, is a piece of perfectly square paper. You can use paper from our Facebook page at Blue Mind Divers where we have uploaded the paper or you can design your own or you can use any piece of square paper that you would like. You're going to need a pair of scissors, you will need some glue, and you're going to need some sort of rod or pencil or pen that you can curl the tail on if you are going to make a fancy tail. I'm going to turn it over to Billy Jo Harned to explain what she is doing as she is folding our beautiful goldfish. We're going to start off and put the print side of our paper down so we have a white sheet. We're going to fold our paper in half. Open it up and fold it into quarters, taking the outside folding it into the center line and doing the same thing on the other side. I'm then going to take the paper, bring this up and just make a little crease mark at the edge, open it back up and fold my paper up halfway and make a crease mark so your paper now looks like this. Open it back up, fold the little corners in down at the bottom, we're now going to do what's called a pocket fold where we open this back up. There's your little pocket. The other side, we open it up. We're now going to make the fins for our goldfish. So we fold each little side of the pocket down. and then we fold them back out. Turn the piece over and fold it in half. There's the side of your goldfish. Now, you're going to take your, the bottom two pieces, and remember the pocket fold we did, we're going to do some more of those. We're going to take this and just turn it up, and then we're going to unfold it and turn it over and fold it the exact same way on the other side. Now I'm going to make another fold turn it back over same thing on the other side now making the pocket fold is a little difficult but not impossible So holding your fish, take the tail and turn it like that and then push the sides together and
and there is your goldfish. This is our traditional origami goldfish and now we're going to go ahead and move on and make him into a fancy tailed goldfish. So I'm taking a little bit of glue and I'm just putting a little dot right down in the bottom there to hold him together. And then we're going to cut the tail and you can cut the tail any way you want. You've seen, oh, I forgot to fold his nose in. Let's go back and do that. Because <laughs> they don't have pointy noses, they have snub noses. So just grab your tip and push it in. There you go. Now he looks more like a goldfish. <laughs> Got a proper sniffer. Now, you can cut the tail any way you want. And you now have four pieces. So take your dowel and just wrap, or if you're using a pencil, whatever you're using, just wrap your tail around it. They don't all have to go the same way. There is your blue mine goldfish and we'll turn this back over to Bobby Joe. All right everybody well thank you for tuning in today on our fancy goldfish. Again blue mine divers on Facebook will have paper that you can download or you can use any kind of paper that you'd like as long as it is a square piece of paper. Big thank you to Billy Joe Harned at azart.org for helping us out with this wonderful project. See you soon.